Hi, I'm Videli with the Skylum Education Team, and in this video, I'll show you how to apply a combination of multiple textures, a filter blend mode, and apply a layer mask to create a painterly image that will look incredible when printed on canvas. Let's get started. Now, this is the original composited image. It looks okay. Now, after spending only a few minutes in Luminar, this is the panel image that looks great on screen, and it's going to look incredible when printed on canvas. Now, the first step is to add a new adjustment layer. We'll be adding textures to this layer, so click the plus icon on the layers control and scroll to add new adjustment layers. To add the texture overlay filter, click the add filters button. You can either scroll through the filter catalog or search for the filter by name. Click the load texture box, browse your computer for the texture, select it and click the open button. Now, if you don't have a collection of textures, you can create your own by taking photos of a brick wall, a cement sidewalk, or anything that has beautiful colors and texture. You can also do a Google search for free textures. You'll find thousands of them. Now, another option is to purchase high quality textures from companies like Flypaper Textures. Either way, start collecting photos of textures, including clouds. Change the amount to 100%. Now to access the blend mode, Click on the filter name and select blend. From here, scroll through the different blend options. I like either overlay or soft light. Let's choose soft light. Repeat this step to add two more textures. Now, this step is optional. I added these two additional textures because I like what they add to the image. Now the last texture is a little harsh, so lower the amount to about 50. I like how this looks, but I don't like the texture on the aviator's face, so let's use a layer mask to hide the texture on her face. Click the Edit Mask button, it looks like a brush, and select Brush as the mask type. Choose Erase, set the opacity to 100%, and now from here, we're just going to paint out the effect on her face and on her skin. Use the left and right bracket keys to make the brush smaller or larger. Now to view the mask, click the visibility icon. It looks like an eye on the mask toolbar. Good. And click the done button to apply the mask. Now note, a filter also has a mask, and we could have used it, but this is why we didn't. A filter mask will only be applied to that filter. So in this case, we would have to mask out the aviator's face three times. By using a layer mask, the mask will be applied to all the filters on that layer, saving us time. A filter mask comes in handy when there are parts of the filter we want to change. Now, I'm not a fan of this texture area here, so by applying a filter mask, we can make a selective change to just this area. Let's quickly complete the effect by adding a new adjustment layer and apply the dramatic and vignette filter. Look how nice that blends the look together. Since Luminar is non-destructive, we can return to the base layer and make additional changes without having to start all over again. Let's make the bottom half of this image a little darker by adding the top and bottom filter. I'm going to go to an extreme just to show the difference. Now, when I click back on the top layer, notice how dark the bottom looks now. Okay, let's adjust it properly. Right about 
here. That looks great. Look how nice this ties it all together. How cool is that? So by adding multiple textures to an image, using the texture overlay filter and changing the filter blend mode and applying a layer mask, we were able to create a painterly effect that will look incredible when printed on canvas. Now, Skylum is dedicated to education. So if you have questions about this technique or a technique you'd like to learn, please don't hesitate to leave a comment below. And don't forget, like, share, and subscribe to this Skylum channel to get the latest videos, tips, and photography inspiration each week. Well, I'm Benelli for the Skylum Education Team. Thanks for watching.